I'm exhausted. I'm physically tired, and I feel brain dead. But you know what? I'm fucking here. I'm here too. And you can and you can go through some shit. Well, I mean, I don't know about shit, but like physically, maybe like a rotator cuff tear or something. But I felt like shit yesterday, but I got a lot of shit done, and that's kind of the point of this video, I guess. Yeah. I mean, uh, basically, this is gonna be revolving around. You, you have to fucking show up. You have to show up. You can't bitch out and always have excuses. You have to put the work in. I'll let you take it away. I mean, yeah, not even take it away. It's just like we get, you know, we started the rant with the idea of helping people out, people out and stuff like that. But now it's actually becoming more of a little bit of a rant because some of the comments we're getting is like, well, you know, I tried this and didn't work. And I tried this, but then this happened. And, uh, you know, now I can't do it because of this and that. Well, dude, like, to be quite honest, you're trying to quit quit being a bitch. I mean, you're going to you're going to have to put the work in. And I'm it just gets old hearing that I can't do this, I can't do that. You know how many times I've showed up to work sick, cra feeling like shit, but you got to put the work in. It's just what it is. Even if you're not at work, you work overtime at home. So, I think we're going to get into the actual rant show and this is what it's going to be about. Yeah. I mean, that's uh, it's it's just a fact. I mean, you know, we've we've like you said, we've tried to give the advice or you know, it, we didn't really quite know where it was going to start. I mean, we knew what we wanted to say or what we, how we wanted to say it, but at this point, it's really, it's kind of overwhelming how many people respond with, well, this I did, or here, but I haven't quite succeeded yet because I stubbed my pinky toe the other, like, what the, like, are you fucking kidding me? That's where it's at. It's like, why have I not succeeded or, or whatever, whatever success may be. I didn't succeed because... Um, you know, my mom died. You know how many fucking people's moms have died? You know how many people that don't even have moms or dads? Yeah. I mean, get over yourself. Yeah. It's Nobody has it easy. And if they do, they're probably going to fail in the long run because they don't even know what hard work even is. And I know a lot of people are about to be like, well, holy shit, that was brutal. Well, holy shit, it's the truth. I mean, it yeah. really is. Just because one part of your life has a hiccup or you have one part of your day that's just stalling, you can't let it affect your entire fucking workflow. You can't. Yeah. Or else you're never going to succeed. You're never going to have that defining moment in which you're like actually achieving your goals because you're going to be too busy on that one problem. Or you're going to be too busy not doing anything yeah. because you have an excuse. And I know we're going to have people say, you know, you guys are all about positivity and this and that. Like, yeah, we are about positivity. But what the, what the problem is is everybody wants to be positive and, and things like that. But then all they do is they talk about negativity. And that's something that just is starting to piss me off because it's like, you want to be positive, but all you do is talk about negativity. Like I know when I get done with this video, I'm going to go bust my ass. I'm going to do some marketing stuff. You know, I'm going to make it happen. I know I'm going to do that. The problem is a lot of you guys, are, you're just not doing the work. You're not putting the work. How many times have we seen this where they're like, oh yeah, I do marketing. I do this and that. Okay, exactly what do you do? And what's their answer usually? That right I can't there. even answer your Silence. damn question. Yeah. Silent there. He's like, well, uh, uh, it's so you're not a marketing expert. You're not. It's a string of filler words. Is really usually it's just like, well, um, uh, I mean, yeah. So what? I mean, that gets annoying. Mm -hmm. Like, god damn, that gets annoying. Yeah. So if if you want help, don't come to us and just have a bundle of excuses. Even though, like, to be quite frank, I don't want to respond to, you know somebody writing a three paragraph long question and then answer and be like, well, that's not really what I was kind of having in mind. Well, then you didn't want the truth because I gave you the truth. You know, what, what do you actually, we're not going to come hold your hand. We can tell you some things that we've done in the past, some things that have worked for us. And we said from the beginning that it's not going to be, you know, like, hey, this is exactly how it's done, done because the fact is there's no exact route to success. Like there's different ways for each person. Now, we can give you things that we've done, you know, that I've done. I can definitely give you that. But Austin can give you ways that has worked for him. 
Yeah, everybody's different. Everybody's path to success is going to be different. But one thing remains the same, and that is you, you, you have to put in the work. You have to... You, you have to have the motivation, you have to have the drive. It's all, there's so many different synonyms for that one thing and it's the motivation and drive to actually succeed and actually put the work in. And you know what, if you're not gonna show up and if you're, after this video, what are you gonna be doing? Are you gonna sit here and, and maybe drop a comment saying, oh, good information guys, or are you gonna go out and you're, are you gonna bust your ass? Are you gonna go and, and do some marketing, or are you going to go out and, and develop your business, or, or are you going to go out? And are you going to bitch about how much money you lost in the first six months of your business? Yep. What do you think? It's I mean, do you know how many businesses I've been involved in that have lost money? Do you know how many businesses I'm involved in right now that have not made money? Uh, there's a bunch of them, but they're going to make money. I've had you know businesses make millions of dollars, and I've had businesses that just fucking failed. It's part of it. Everybody's so y'all are so scared of failing that you just give up. I mean, that's just not the way it works. But the mentality is there. How many of his businesses are going to make money? How many of them? You, it's the mindset. My heart's pounding right now. Like that's, it's, it's the passion. drive. Passion. It's, it's the drive. It's the passion. You know you're going to be there. Yeah. Don't have an excuse. And that goes back to the be okay with saying you're great. But it, you can't say you're great if you go home and, you know, sleep. Honestly, you're sleeping eight, ten hours a day. You're not. It's going to be very, very tough. <laughs> I mean, it's just going to be tough. I, I don't even know what a normal sleep pattern is anymore. Yeah. I lost it a long time ago. Not advocating really not good. sleeping, but to be honest, you know, four to six hours a night, that would be a great night for me. Um, yeah. I, you know, I, but I enjoy, I enjoy not sleeping much. I like to just push and push and push and push and not having a baby, but just keep going. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, you got to have some kind of passion. If you don't have some passion, don't fucking bitch in the comments. You know, don't say, oh, Dustin, your hair's falling out. Uh, Austin, you got pretty eyes. You don't say that shit. Yeah, went, or, right. you, or, or yeah. you can. I mean, I'll take yeah. a compliment, but it is what it is. But anyway, the whole point is this video was going to happen because of Twitter messages, d direct messages on Twitter, uh, tweets that we, we've received, messages on YouTube, emails, you name it. People looking for advice, but... When we give it to them, they complain because it's not what they want to hear. If it's yeah. not what you want to hear, fucking don't ask for it. If it's not what you want to hear, then you're not even trying. It, it, People can't, they can't take constructive uh, cr criticism. Yeah. Any criticism. Like, you just want us to baby you and change your diaper for you. That ain't going to happen. No, because everybody's path is different. But we're giving you the baseline of what everyone should have. And it's passion is one of the top Three, if you don't have it, forget it. Just stop. Yeah, pa passion and deci decision-making. Like, dude, exactly. We, we need to do a video on decision-making because the amount of people that say they're going to do something and they don't do it because they want to overthink it, but then they, you know, it, it might work, it might... Fucking, I've done three of those things the time you thought about thinking about. Like, who gives a shit? I don't care if you thought about it. You didn't do it. So, I mean... Exactly. It, and we'll do, we should do a whole dedicated video on that. But, yeah. uh... I mean... Uh, it's been, it's been a long time coming, and I say a long time, it's been like six episodes coming that this was going to happen. But hey, you know what? It just sets us up for a bunch of great videos in the future. And you it know, does, and I think there should be more about, you know, like, like this. I mean, because it, it, if we're going to be real and we set out to do this from the beginning, we're going to be real with the audience, well, it's getting really real now because now the stupid comments are annoying me. And it's not even, no comment stupid unless you're just going to be like, you know, how do I do this? And then you don't accept any answer. You don't even try. Like, it's just... It, it, it boggles my mind. Yeah, and those amount of people are abundant. So, you know, we'll, we'll break it down. You guys get the gist of this video. Fucking have the drive to do something. Have the passion to do it. Make a decision. That's going to be the... I think that's honestly going to probably let's be do, the next video. Let's do make a decision. Like, that That just, will be... That'd be huge. That would be huge. And maybe like a top something exactly. or whatever. Oh, look at that. We just made a decision in less than five seconds. So, <laughs> you know what? There it is. Anyway, guys, you get the point. So... The point is, quit being a bitch... And take your bitchiness and roll it into success. How about that? Exactly. Does that make sense? I don't even really know. I don't, I don't, really, I don't even really care. You, you, you know what? Hey, it's the way that we said it. My so freaking heart's pounding. I'm pissed off. We're going to run with it like that. But I'm motivated. Ha! See you.